what's going on guys welcome to the sixth episode of the boondocks let's get into this let's go okay so tell us a little bit about yourself i'm the founder of 23 different radical leftist organizations including the africans fighting racism and oppression or afro if you will oh damn uh the black revolutionary organization or bro uh yeah this is all you hear people tell me i look like bill cosby all the time i mean <laughs> excuse me Dr. Bill Cosby, especially Bill. when I wear these sunglasses. It was yeah, bad for a yeah, sec. my name is Riley, son. But you know, niggas call me AKA Riley Escobar. You know what I'm saying? Because I be in the streets, you know? I got all kinds of names like HR Paper Stacks, uh, also <laughs> known as AKA Horse Choker. Um, Horse and Choker. Also the Black Revolutionary Underground Heroes. So my granddad's wearing this okay. Bill Cosby shades. And I'm like, look blind and then i thought boom i got an idea i know how we can get this money and i made a tape if my granddad has one weakness it's <laughs> He's hey they're my weakness too bro ever since he had a bleach fight with his first wife and went blind is he fully blind now <clears throat> all he's got in this world is his car dorothy the car's in pretty bad shape and everyone knows Damn. the bitches don't really check niggas with beat up car. For real, bro. If you ain't got a car, you ain't getting no bitches. Now nah, I'm joking. You obviously still will get some because I don't have a car and I still get bitches. But you know, the, the bitches might come less frequently. You get it? So get a car, man. Them, you know. I mean, you can still get a girl, a girl without a car, but it helps. You know, when you can pick her up, shit like that. <laughs> Same, man. I'm Robert Freeman driving. Oh my God. I'm tired of driving this piece of car I got. Give him something better. <laughs> Maybe if he had Who's a gonna give him? car, he might be able to get a date. And I have to pay for it. Please. What is this? Oh, hold up, hold up. Is this one of those things where they're like, oh, feel sorry for us, so give us something. I don't know, an organization or something for a documentary? I don't know, I can't tell. <laughs> oh, my day. Please, exhibit. Pimp my ride. Oh, it's what he said. For my grandfather. <laughs> Oh, for America. <laughs> What's up, y'all? This X to the Z exhibit. Oh my days! I'm gonna see the exhibit. Time. And we about to pimp his grandfather's car. Let's Joy. go. Can need some lotion. That's actually exhibit's voice. Oh snap! It's exhibit. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> what up, homie? I'm here to pimp your ride. <laughs> Who the hell is that at the door? Oh yeah. Stay down. Well, he's not Yo, supposed to know, is he? Why are we hiding? Are you kidding? If he comes out here and finds his favorite rapper exhibit fixing a pimp his ride, he'll have a heart attack. For real? I'm his favorite rapper? His life. Man loves your whole catalog, and I want a toilet seat in the trunk. Get the hell out of here. You ain't stealing my man. Hey, man. Hey, hold on. Hey, you know. Oh. Linda, chill, G. Oh my days, dude. I've loved and cared for that vehicle for 30 years. You think I'm let some damn rapper put a goldfish in the dashboard? Hoes love goldfish, granddad. You two need your own sitcom. All you gotta do is get on TV with a sob story and people give you free stuff. I still ain't gonna lie to you. That's actually kind of true. One thing I can't stand is lying. I'm a Christian man. You ain't got to lie. I'll lie. Just play along. They gonna fix my transmission? <laughs> fix everything, bro. Dude, he's getting really blind now. Isn't Sorry it? about the misunderstanding. And now, where's that boy? What's his name? Inhibit? The whole catalog, <laughs> huh? <laughs> inhibit. Y'all gonna fix my transmission, right? <laughs> Must it inhibit? Yep. Every time I lose a tooth, the tooth fairy takes it away and leaves a dollar under my pillow. I wonder how old there she is. No such thing as a tooth fairy. Then who's leaving the money? Probably your parents. They have both the cash and the access to your room. <laughs> but they've lied to me. Because the truth hurts, Jasmine. The world is a hard and lonely place, and nobody gets anything for free. Rose Afro is good. One day, you and everyone you know is going to die. Max. Ain't nothing to be scared of. It's the next phase of life. No? You enjoy abusing people's illusions. I respect that. 
hell are you, mate? It's thankless work. He looks like an oh, FBI dude. Nobody really. Just thought you might want to talk to someone who understands. You don't know me. I know you better than you think, Huey Freeman. Whoa. He's gone? What the hell? Impossible. I'm not interested. But granddad, I am being followed by a secret government agent. He knew stuff about us, like 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 the stupid Bill Cosby sunglasses thing. Well, these stupid sunglasses got us a new car. So you say the car stops Why is and he... the wheels keep spinning? Well, listen to Huey more That's so, amazing. maybe. All I'm saying is when Exhibit brings that car back, you gonna be bitches. What did you call me? No, no, I mean bitches. Like, you gonna get. Like you gonna have so many bitches. That's what is gonna call you. No disrespect. Mmm, granddad bitches <gasps> Freeman. Hey, uh, Got a nice ring to it. Uh? Me? Damn, he's gonna push. Good morning, Freeman family. What in the hell? Oh, Mr. Freeman, is right? I know I you can't see us because you're blind, but we're from Extreme Makeover Home Edition, and we're gonna build a new wing onto your house. Brought to you by Sears. Cut. Okay, okay let's, let's do it again, in. people, and get a reverse Come angle on. from inside the house. Oh. Come on. What's the catch? Just keep pretending you're blind. That's it. That's it. I maybe uh might have told him you was running a homeless shelter out of here. Come on, we have to work together. We're running out of time. I had to tell him something. Watch your back, people. That's not a good It's not like we don't have a big ass house already. Don't trip. We just find some people to act homeless. By the way, I told him to put in a grotto. Bro. Yeah, like you have to. Riley, man. Like you have to, right? You ain't never lied about that. That's true. That we lost that much. Yeah, Broski had a whole mansion. Right? Was he imagining this is his crib? Big Daddy, you know who the girls call me Big Daddy. That was the dream, bro. Bacon. Don't mind if I do. She naked? Naked cutie pie. Yo! <laughs> oh, my days, I would have to do some muting. You have an amazing grotto. Please, Mr. Hefner, call me Okay, Mr. Bitches. Uh. The homeless people are needed in makeup. Huh? What? The homeless people? This is a homeless shelter, right? If they no. was here all the time, they wouldn't be homeless, would they? It's a shelter, not a prison. <sighs> Beat it. Little bastard. <laughs> uh, excuse me. Uh, I've actually seen this show. They're gonna demolish the house. <laughs> Hello? Do you hear me? <laughs> Come on, let's find some homeless people. <laughs> Damn, Look awful home. Mind. Down. Or listening to Huey, and he's the most level headed out of all of them. I found this little homeless girl, and I know how your grandfather loves to take care of homeless people. What the hell are you doing here? Your brother called, said if I bring Jasmine over, I could sing on the show. I could sing on the Hi, show. I'm Tom. So, like I was saying, my true passion is singing. A heart is a house. Of love. Word. If your granddad has one weakness, it's bitches. Of course, they're my weakness too. What do you want with me? I know, right? It's complicated, Huey. Uh, I'm a secret agent sent to spy on you. Okay, maybe it's not that complicated. If this house <laughs> is not done, the spies the hell was that? introduce themselves to people they spy on. What's that? What spy school did you go to? Eh, uh, I'm too old to be sneaking around. Excuse us, coming through. Leave me alone. Look, just because my job is to watch your every move and eavesdrop on every telephone call and monitor your every email doesn't mean we can't be friends. Dude, God, come on, man. You can't be just disappearing like this. Makes Excuse you actually start me. to think Did he's you in his head. Me talking to someone a second ago, right here, dressed like y'all. Wasn't really looking. Sorry. Where are we putting the fried chicken? To is he not real then? But that's I mean, impossible. everything we see is a false reality. Yes, sir. I've been living with the Freeman for three months now. They the cleanest color folks you ever did see. Hey, this is playing along My nicely. Mother, um, she left me in the dumpster, and you should give Riley a movie theater. <laughs> oh my Jesus Christ! We have some release paperwork for you to sign. <laughs> Hold Mr. on. Let me read it first. 
<laughs> yeah, good one, good one. Now, just sign here and there. Great. <laughs> excellent, excellent. Thanks. Word. Whoa. I'm being shadowed by a secret agent. Really? I can't even Ooh. tell if it's real now or not. I don't know. Kind of just pops up out of nowhere and then disappears. You mean like the Tooth Fairy? No, I don't mean like the Tooth Fairy. Sounds like the Tooth Fairy to me. <laughs> you can believe in secret agents and I can't believe in the Tooth Fairy? That's messed up, Huey. Go eat something out of a dumpster, you street urchin. Oh. Jeez, producer's going crazy. What's up, some bull. Go hydraulics. Never have you imagine. Granddad, all we gotta do is keep up the act. We gonna have a new car and a new uh, house. All because we didn't listen to Huey. Dorothy! When we first saw Dorothy, the only thing that worked was the off switch. That car was so old it ran on unleaded coal. But take a look at the new coal. Dorothy. Yo! Jeez. But you can't see the Ooh. Looking clean. Oh, give me a I said that's my color too. I really hope they get to keep it. Are they gonna call him up for being blind? For not being blind? What's making the rims keep spinning? Queen, you're supposed to be blind. Oh yeah. What the hell? He's not blind. I was like, man, Granddad done f***ed it up for everybody. Granddad. Teach that boy a lesson. Trying to rip off the TV show. Bro, your house is destroyed, man. What do I know about acting blind? That big ass. Look at this dude's belly, bro. Just peek it up. Trying to get a bigger shirt. I can see clearly now the rain has gone. Are they gonna get the house I can fixed? See all obstacles in my way. I mean, hear that note, though. I love that song. Is he gay? Oh. <laughs> what the hell's going on with this guy? Is he gay? That's just getting way too weird. Come on, man. Gentlemen, don't leave. Gentlemen. Come on. What about my house? I'm not about this boy. I'm listening to the boy. I should have listened to the boy. But I should have been blind the whole time. It's too tame. Wait a minute. I can't believe he's not blind, man. Not blind, man. Please. You did this to me. Riley, it's your fault. Damn, the whole house is going to get left like that. Get the watermelon patch, man. What? Oh my jeez. Yo, anybody home? You know you can see us. Fellas, we thought about it and well, here's your car back. Nice. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, it's his original Thank car. You. Yeah, <laughs> we kinda feel bad for you guys. Besides, our lawyers told us we couldn't keep the car. Oh, it's the original car, it has to be. We'll just charge you off for all the work we did on it. Thirty-five thousand four hundred twenty-three dollars and eight cents. Yo, you ain't getting that. Bebop, bebop. Keep the damn car. Exhibition. 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 Right, here's the invoice, and take your time with that. <laughs> Looks like money gonna be tight around here for a minute. <laughs> Come on, man, donate a couple quid, fam. She oh, at least they got the car. I thought they were gonna get the old one back. I say we came out of here. Slap him. <laughs> Slap him. Come here. Is this FBI guy real dog? I've come up with a name for you. The White Shadow. Hmm. I'm white. I'm shadowing you. It's very clever. And I've decided that you're a figment of my overactive imagination. Ah. Uh, now who's hiding from reality? He's a kid, we can't forget you're paranoid, this. Huey doesn't mean we're not out to get you. If you are real, why me? Oh, come on. You underestimate yourself. It's a shame what happened to the house. You warned them. They wouldn't listen to me. Damn. They never listen to me. 
this would be me if I started using this platform to start spreading a lot of things I consider to be truth. They'll be on my ass. <laughs> I know you want to save the world, Huey. But sometimes people have to learn lessons on their own. The hard way. Damn. Well, can't miss the idol. If you ever want to talk, remember, I'm always listening. So he's uh, not real. I'm going to assume he's not real then. It's just in his imagination. Obi-Wan Kenobi said, Your eyes can deceive you. Don't trust them. Damn. It seems to be getting harder. Distinguishing reality from the illusions people make for us. Or from the ones we make for ourselves. I don't know. Maybe that's part of the plan. To make me think I'm crazy. Maybe, dog. It's working. Anybody want a drink out the fridge? Or an espresso? Oh, they're living in the car. <laughs> Yo, this is all Riley's fault, night, pretty much. Well. Good night, How good your night. Good night, Huey. Good night, Riley. Good night, Huey's imaginary secret agent friend. <laughs> Granddad, Huey's imaginary friend tried to touch me in a private place. Oh, my God. <laughs> They're lucky they live in a nice neighborhood. Otherwise, they would have been robbed by now. Oh, my days. Jeez. I thought they were going to get, like, their house fixed in the end or something like that. But I wonder if it's going to carry on to the next episode. I can't even be sure. But that was good. Good as always, this show does make me laugh a lot. Hope you guys did enjoy too. If you did, leave a like and subscribe and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.